some vacuum cleaners will literally be around when the nuclear explosion has happened and cockroaches roam the earth again. This is going to be one such vacuum cleaner. The Samsung SU33. This is the 1800 watt version. This is usually something that I wouldn't really give a second glance to, but it came my way in a fairly complicated sale of a Dyson recently and a couple of other machines that flew around, so I thought we may as well have a look at it. Yes, hello, my vacuum cleaner chums. How are you today? Yes, this is an odd machine, really, because they are thunderously common. They were very cheap when they came out, but they're also very, very reliable. I have had a few in, a few come and go, normally for just a belt, literally. They don't even clog up that much. They're fairly well built. And this one is actually complete, which is one of the reasons I thought we may as well do something with it. Because it has everything. It's got its jewel upholstery and dusting brush. This is very reminiscent of the Electrolux design. Oh, by the looks of it, you can even shove the crevice tool in there as well. We have the original turbo tool, which seems in okay order and we have the combination extension rod and crevice tool the crevice tool again fits into the end of this horrible thing so you can rake your sofa from afar and yeah that's really quite odd to see on these because they were cheap they've normally gone through the oh here i've got a free rubbish hoover in my garage tied that over and obviously they then come with you know this clip missing or the tools missing no this one is 100% complete and that obviously needs some sort of thought yeah it's also very full but we'll be all right for now it's it's clean ish dirt because it's been in the house underneath here we have a balloon caught in the cycle oh, I've used it a little bit actually it, you know, not a bad old thing indeed. Under here we have the filter, which isn't too bad. Oh, and an air freshener. We'll get that out. Actually, no, we'll leave that in. Because I did have this in. Basically, the way the three-way worked was the lady had a Mila C2 Compact, which you would have seen on Mila Week. And she asked me to diagnose it, and obviously the motor was scrap. And she went, oh, well, you know, she really wants a cylinder, but doesn't have one but her friend gave her this so I had this in and that's when I changed the belt on it and cleaned the filter and then luckily that day a colleague of mine from work gave me a free Dyson DC28 so that got me furbished sold to this lady who then gave me this and here we are so I've had this and Amina C2 off of her <sighs> very complicated um, there's not a lot else to really show you this is the post motor filter which should actually um is it paper yes it's paper so i can't really wash that which is a bit of a shame obviously not filtration is not fully its strong point bless it and underneath we have a fairly softish but okay brush roll and not a whole lot else oh. Yeah, quite well timed actually this because I've just stripped down a vacuum on my carpet and it needs a clean so we can recline this and turn it on. <laughs> Sounds like there's 
a huge air leak coming from it somewhere. Oh, I put that away. But it, it has suction. I mean, oh, I'll take this horrible hose off and turn it on. It sounds, it feels like it's coming from here. I don't know if I have that on right. This is completely clogged and causing the pressure to come out elsewhere. It, it's why these things hang around for so long, because it's not terrible, even if it's current condition. If you knew no better, you would happily run this around your house and think you were doing a good job. And yeah, that's why you still see so many of them today. So there we go. The Samsung SU3364. Before refurbishment, I am now going to take the hose and the pre-rotor filter off to put them in the washing machine because I have some stuff waiting to go in and this can go in the pile to see you another day when it is working as it should after a full refurbishment. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed and I and this Samsung will see you soon. Bye bye.